At the first sign of a mild cold, I felt incredible guilt as I may have exposed my friends and family uh, to the risk of COVID-19 at home. Fortunately, my test was negative, but the experience forced me to acknowledge my fears of contracting COVID-19 at work, bringing the disease home to my husband and daughter, and ultimately accept and acknowledge that I'm doing everything I can within my power to try to reduce that risk. All of our patients are so anxious. You turn on the TV, you turn on the radio, all you hear is about coronavirus and COVID-19. Our biggest challenge is managing patient expectations, and we have been able to do that. Almost on a daily basis, we're trying to explain to them we can't always provide the medication they require, the flu vaccines they require, but we are working hard to meet their expectations and explain to them what difficulties there are. One of the challenges for me during this pandemic has been not being able to catch up with my friends. I have a close group of friends from medical school and we used to catch up every week on a Friday night uh, over dinner and it'd be a great time to debrief over you know, stresses at work. So I've been really missing that but one of the things we've been doing to catch up instead is um, have some Zoom dates and it's a great way that we are staying in touch and supporting each other. I initially found it challenging to find a balance working from home. It can be easy for work life to seep into home life, especially when you're home all the time and there's such a lot to be done at the moment. But I've found that by turning off non-essential notifications and maintaining clear boundaries, such as not checking work emails outside of my working hours, um, that I've been more productive when I am sitting down to work. Oh, and I am enjoying having this little friend nearby.